What's up guys, your man Neo Moses. We're here with a new video today. We're gonna to be talking about the recent event that just came up today with I know this may come as a shock to many of you, but as of today, I will be streaming exclusively on Mixer. I know, I know, it's exciting. Uh, yes, yes, the handsome guy in the front. Uh, how is this going to affect your gaming abilities? It really won't. It's the same me, just a different platform. Yes. What are you most excited for about this change? You know, I feel like this is a really good chance to get back in touch with my roots and really remember why I fell in love with streaming in the first place. Ninja, 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 Wow. I mean, that was one of the best questions I I've ever been asked. Uh, wow. Uh, any other questions? Uh, yeah. uh, Bushy. How would this affect your win-loss ratio? I really wouldn't worry too much about my win-loss ratio. I'll be just fine. Steve, the button. Steve. Boy Ninja in Twitch for stream. Now, um, just going to my computer to look up something a little specific to look up because I'm looking on that um, information, particular information, but I know there's a reason why. Um, basically, Ninja wanted to take his time to focus on being his, you know, being his personal time in his life. He wants to focus clearly on his life more than being more on Twitch because it's like more 24 hours the way it seemed because um, I watched a lot of his streams while I was at work and most times I don't get to watch a lot of it I just watch some of the replay or some of the real live play so I think uh, Ninja leaving Twitch with his followers if they're following still um, is a good idea with Microsoft for his streaming now on this stream now so being on that position um, I think that makes sense for him I don't think he should be losing a lot of money because um, yeah, because the Microsoft Mixer is a better idea in this case, because honestly, Sonic, you know, Sonic might take a position, this is my theory, if Sonic Fox from the FGC if gets a new position, he might take the position in Twitch, if that's the case, if he's that popular to that point though. Um, now, Ninja, Fortnite, I think that was a good position for him to go to Microsoft Mixer because it was easier for him around his daily life. Because that guy has a lot going on. He got married. I don't know if he has kids on the way, but he, uh, you know he's trying to get used to his normal life. The guy's 26. It's about my age. Um, and I'm pretty sure he wants to enjoy his life with his wife. I mean, the guy's married. Come on now. Um, most guys don't have that chance and they're single, but he has a chance and he's married. So he enjoys both worlds. Um, but I think for Ninja to be in a position now to sell himself to go to, well, the way they bought him over the Microsoft Mixer is a better choice in him being there. Um, I'm going to throw up a few things on my video. You're going to see a couple of things posted on the, on the site when I'm reading off of BBC on the news. Because um, obviously it says Amazon's greatest streamer platform, Twitch, has lost one of its biggest stars. And he's not the last star, of course, there's a lot of the stars, but he's the biggest one with Drake and, you know, um, Travis Scott, etc. You know, so the other artists who are on there. Um, he is going to be memorable on there, but the thing is, he only lost, what, he had 14.7 million, of course, and Mixer launched in 2016, not too long ago, two years ago. So that's fresh competition for Twitch. Now, if Twitch is going to get something to bounce back, who are they gonna bring on to replace Ninja? Cause the other bigger, the other stars are not to that level where Ninja is. I think that's a big idea to look at. Like who are they gonna bring? 
I thought my like I said my theory was probably Sonic Fox from the FGC because the FGC is not that popular, especially knowing how big it is in other platforms like like the first person shooters, the um what else, um Dota, um what's it called? The other games are also popular with the money involved and the uh, car games and Magic, um the Gathering. Um, Etc. But there's a lot of other games that people are populating with their biggest players. Fortnite's players, first person, or well, third person shooter would be Ninja. Um, FGC would be the Justin Wong. Justin Wong. Um, who, I don't know. He can't even say his name. He's in Korea. Um, Kudan. But there's a lot of other players involved in the FGC that will have a better position now than they ever had before with Twitch now needing a position filled. I think, if anything, you know, I'm a fan. I like his gaming. He's a good player. Um, I think Sonic Fox might take that position, if the case be. If not, who else might pick, who might be put in that position? I don't know. Um, I'm saying right now, it's still a lot of information on this that's still going around since so been today. It's today so far. It's been only what, what six hours since it came up. Um, yeah, I mean. In a statement, Microsoft said it was thrilled to bring Mr. Belvins on board. Belvins on board. Make sure the place that was formed around being positive, welcoming from a day one, from a day one, and we look forward to energy Ninja has in this community to bring. Community will bring. Uh, well, we'll see if they bring them because Twitch has their followers and Ninja going there. Uh, I've been having, he said that I have been holding on to this for quite some time. He said, I'm just super excited to let everyone know I'll be streaming on Mixer full time. Now, and I'm honestly at a loss of words. I'm freaking out of, freaking out in the best way. I feel like I'm going to get back to the streaming roots. Okay. The streaming roots. I mean, the dude, he's also a player from Halo. If anybody didn't know that, fun fact. Ninja has a lot of. Microsoft days were playing with Xbox. I'm guessing that's what he's saying. The roots, maybe, we're, maybe recurring back at those times. The financial terms of the deal had not been made public. We'll never know. We won't know yet. He'll let it know. He'll be known soon. And the fan base is divided. So, uh, need to declare the fan base may be likely to tune in, no matter the platform. At the same time, Twitch stream to scoop up on more heavy views and ninja streams. At the time of writing, 80,000 subscribers to Nail Vincent channel. 80,000? Wow. Well, it's not a lot, but it is a good number. 80,000. You know, remember, he has a lot of followers, kids, middle-aged, teenagers, adults, maybe older people, you know, so, and artists too, so don't forget Drake and his other people. So, in a statement now, Mr. Velvet's departed Amazon saying, said, we love watching Ninja on Switch. Um, Amazon is saying Twitch over the years and I'm proud of all his accomplishments for him and his family and gaming community. We wish him the best luck in his future endeavors. So as we have it now that the Amazon is wishing the best because they're the owner of Twitch and that's good. Um, and that's it really I have much to say besides I think this is an opportunity for FGC to take a position in Twitch where Ninja left the opening. If anybody was to take it, I would say Sonic Fox or somebody because why not someone take a position where the Twitch needs someone to be in that position as a star? Where basically they're having the most gaming, you know, feed and the most followers. I mean, someone's going to come in there sooner or later. I don't know who, but I'm hoping someone comes in there with the right fire to keep that going. Because Ninja kept it going for a long time. And look who he brought on. He brought on artists. I mean, I don't even know if anybody brought celebrities on their own Twitch to let them play with them and watch them live. That's crazy, yo. That is crazy. Um, but that's it for today for me on this topic because honestly, there's nothing more to talk about. Uh, hopefully, we'll see what happens with Mixer. Give me your thoughts in your comments below. What do you think about Ninja leaving from Twitch to Mixer on Microsoft? And tell me your thoughts. Is it a good idea or bad idea? And are you a follower? If so, why do you follow him? Give me a good reason too. Do you like this game or do you like his personality? Or do you like this being his fan, that he's a good gamer? And if you're a good gamer too, why don't you get on there and try to, you know, try to talk to him. If you do, get him a shout out, let him know that, you know, you got to support, support him no matter what. That's a good way to show support to a new guy and a new, a new streamer in the mixer now. 
Um, be sure to hit that like video below and hit that like and also subscribe and also check out my other videos around other gaming F F from the FPS and also from the FGC fighting games I play in the community. Alright guys, hope you guys have a good week, a good weekend and peace.